Linda Park and her golden retriever Dakota started their morning like any other day. Dakota's owner says he loves the cold, so she didn't worry when he wandered off. And I figured he was underneath my deck, but my neighbor came running over, knocking on the door, telling me that Dakota had gone through the ice. The usually unadventurous dog went for a stroll on the thin ice of nearby Little Ossipee Lake and quickly found himself in the deep end. A neighbor called 911. I couldn't believe it. I, you know, I was worried about how in the world am I going to get him out of there. When the call came into the Waterboro Fire Department around 8 a.m. this morning, Captain Langevin, being a dog owner himself, didn't hesitate to suit up and head out to save Dakota. Oh, I was just going to go in and get the dog. I mean, there was no doubt about it. When Waterboro's Fire Department made it to Dakota, the 100-pound five-year-old dog was growing tired by the minute. These photos show Captain Langevin's daring rescue. Yeah, I was able to walk out maybe about 50 feet, and uh, the last, you know, 25, 30 feet or so, I, I crawled out and I eventually went through, you know, and I was got in the water with him and able to get him out from there. The rescue took less than half an hour, but it was enough time for Dakota's owner to realize she wants to raise money so the fire department can purchase a rescue sled should another call for help come in. It was a dog that went down, but I think it's an eye-opener for people to realize that they shouldn't be going out on the lake, but also the rescuer who's rescuing the person or the dog, if they had a sled, that would save their life. As for the rest of Dakota's day, he sat by the fire and licked himself for quite a while and had some ice cream.